time, and how have you gotten mom wrapped up in it? I didn't do anything. Okay, so mom just happened to be getting rid of a gun the same night someone you hated was shot and killed? Have you come by to gloat? About, about what? Alexis Davis. Haven't you heard that she's been brought in as a person of interest in Kate's murder? No, I, I hadn't. Oh, right, well, she's being questioned right now. I guess not. Whatever happened last night, I am gonna get to the bottom of it. Oh, wow. she's working on it. That Molly will this morning on Soap Chat. Yeah, we're getting our weekly download of the daytime so, drama on GH. From a shouting awful. match. Well, oh, that was so good. To Jason and Anna trying to understand each other. There's so much we've got to wrap our heads around. I want to talk about the shouting match first. Yes. So for those of you that did not see Monday's episode, hopefully you have at this point. But if you haven't, it was a... Uh, very anticipated conversation that I be well, we both believe needs to continue. It was between Alexis and her two daughters, Molly and Christina, and they sort of had it out, but they need to continue to have it out because there's lots that needs to be said about Christina's behavior. Well, let me tell you, yesterday, for those of you who were able to watch yesterday, we see Molly going to the police department yep to um, let them know what she believes occurred with Christina. And of course, we all know that Christina took the gun, but that wasn't the gun that killed Kate. So even still, I think um, we are supporting Molly. Team in Molly this? all the way. Team, Team Molly. Absolutely. And you know what? They're keeping Molly in the dark. And I get it. Like, Michael and Christina want to keep her in the dark because they don't want her involved. I get it. She's the assistant DA. But that's probably not the right decision it's to make It's not. Right. They, should, they should talk about the truth. Let's go on and talk about Anna and Jason yes. and those scenes because yeah. I feel like Anna has become very smug. And a hypocrite. Hypocrite! Let's be honest. Now, she has done very shady things when she yes. was working for the WSB. Shadier, some would argue, than what Jason does. Yes. And she's preaching to him that he needs to be on the right side of the law. And why are you not helping me take down Sonny? You are asking a lot of a man who never promised you anything. Right. But yet he helped her. Correct. He helped her to, you know, get Valentine away in yes. time. And, and again, all. breaking the law. Breaking the law. It's okay for her to do it, but it's not okay for him to not want to help the police. Something he's never done. I don't know. Very, I, I've, very I've had it hypocritical. With her. Yeah. And it's, it, it actually is breaking my heart watching this because I really liked their relationship. I, I liked know. that they were working together. How they had a friendship. They really had a good, solid friendship. Yep. And they had a, ultimately the same goal, right? At one point. Ultimately. But now, yeah, I don't, all of that's gone. And it was, it's just very unfortunate. But in all the scenes, even yesterday, she was very smug seeing Carly and Brennan and just everybody. And, and now the doctor that we know, the John Doe right. and everything. Yeah. Like being very accusatory with him too. What is the deal with her? I don't know. I don't know. Gosh, I just don't know. For those of you that don't know, they are going to recast. Lulu is going to wake up from her coma, which is That's huge. Right. They've already picked the actress who's going to fill her shoes. Um, unfortunately, it's not the actress that we've come it's to Alexa love. Havens, who played Babe on All My Children. Correct. Were... I don't remember her, but a lot of our viewers yeah. do. So she's going to be obviously a very welcomed, welcomed face to the yeah. show, and she should be popping up here anytime soon. Yeah. Hey, um, of course you can watch GH, right? Yeah. Weekdays? Absolutely, right here on ABC7 at 2 p.m. And of course, I just want to real quickly throw it out there that Lucky, now obviously he's made his appearance, so pretty soon he's going to be on his way to Port Charles. Cannot wait. He can maybe save his sister. Well, can I just say? Yes. You sound like you're trying to wrap up this segment. Oh, oh no, I don't want to wrap it up. Okay, all right. Well, I kind of felt that way. No, 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 no. Um, next week is your birthday. Uh-huh. You are not going to be here the day of your birthday. Right. And there are some special friends from Port Charles who had a message for you. Are you serious? Diane Pathew from the cast of General Hospital. Someone gave us a scoop that it is your birthday today. So on behalf of everyone here in Port Charles, Happy, happy birthday. birthday! We hope you and Tracy can come out and visit us soon. <laughs> oh my God, Tracy, oh my God, that is so I'm so Sarah. excited about oh this. God. <laughs> Tracy, that was really nice. You have no idea. I've waited for God. this. <laughs> this is so special. Oh my God. Get in here. Such a cheese ball. Oh <laughs> Bring a Kleenex. Cry. Is that the ugly cry? The oh my God. Do I have the ugly cry and be on TV? Oh, <laughs> oh my gosh.
gosh, you guys, that is so. Oh, get in here! Oh. oh my gosh, I'm so. Her oh birthday is next oh. Wednesday. Oh my god, that and, is so um, nice. <laughs> you guys are so sweet. That was so. Oh. Nice. How did you get them to do that? Tracy's got, got that. She that. knows exactly. so many Bippity, people. Mm -hmm. Like, Boppity. don't let this woman fool you. As she has so many people in her back pocket. <laughs> yes. As our producer, Tony. Thank you, Tony. Yes. Yeah, it was so nice, you guys. Thank that's you. That's the one of the biggest birthday big gifts you can ever get. Oh isn't my it? God, that is so special. Now, like, you just have, to get, have you been on GH yet? No, no I know. that's the next. That 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 would be cool, right? You guys got to get out there. Working on it. Yeah, working on it. That. Oh, what role would you want to play on GH? I don't care, girl. You'd be you'd be great as Lois's best friend. I would be great as Lois. And Lois was friend. right in there yeah, too. I would be. Oh, really? And wasn't that the kid so that you guys excited. interviewed? Yeah. Yes. 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 Well, you know him because he's been to Windy City Live. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You guys, that was so special. Too. And oh, uh, Chase and Brooklyn. That was so nice. Yay. I mean, the fact that they did that, that's so sweet of them. That's so happy. Yes. So awesome. That was so nice. <laughs> that was so nice. Thank you. But, uh, Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.